Hi guys, my name is Chirayu Bhatt and we are going to study monetary policy today. We are going to study expansionary monetary policy as well as contractionary monetary policy. Let's first of all understand what monetary policy is. You need to go through the word monetary. First four letters M-O-N-E, it talks about money. So the policy that talks about money, the policy that deals with money is called monetary policy. It is the policy that deals with the money supply in an economy. So monetary policy basically deals with the money supply in an economy. In the expansionary monetary policy, what federal bank or central bank or reserve bank of a nation, uh, what they do, they will lower the interest rate. Why do they lower the interest rate? Because in expansionary monetary policy, remember, economy is going through recession. In expansionary monetary policy, federal bank or central bank of the nation wants their consumer to increase their spending in the market. So they will lower the interest rates. They want the consumers, the citizens of the nation to borrow more from the money and they want that particular money to go to the uh, consumer expenditure and they want the investment to increase as well. That's why they will lower the interest rate in the expansionary monetary policy. And this is the same diagram that we have studied in the expansionary fiscal policy. So everything is same, the diagram is same. The only change is that in expansionary monetary policy, uh, central bank will lower the interest rates and that will eventually increase the consumer spending. It will eventually increase the investment in an economy and it will eventually increase the GDP and thus the price level will go up as well. Let's come to contractionary monetary policy. In the expansionary monetary policy, they reduce the interest rates. In the contractionary monetary policy, they increase the interest rates. Why do they increase the interest rates? When the interest rates will be high, higher, lesser people will go to the banks to borrow the money. So consumer expenditure and investments would go down. So therefore, the GDP would uh, fall back as well. And thus, uh, your original GDP will come back and your original price level will come down as well. This is the same diagram as we have studied in the contractionary fiscal policy. The diagram is the same, just uh, monet uh, ex contractionary monetary policy talks about uh, increasing the interest rates. That was our uh, expansionary as well as contractionary monetary policy. Remember, you can follow me on Facebook, Google+, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube. You can follow me on my website as well. Thank you.